Hello everyone, I'm Kavina Siobhagasov and I'm a final year psychology student from the National University of Malaysia. So today, I will be demonstrating a very simple brain game and I have my sister here to be my assistant. Ching! This game is called the trust game and all you need is just a deck of cards, 52 cards. And this game is about following your instinct. Instinct is like this gut feeling that you get where you can't find, you can't provide a logical reasoning for it. So, shall we try it on our volunteers? Let's go! Hi Ma! Hi. Okay, so today we have a very simple game and it's about, uh, we're going to encourage Emma to trust our instincts. Okay, alright? So between the number 10 to number 30, I want Amma to just pick one number that jives with Amma. 10. 10. Okay, I'm giving Amma a second chance. Do you want to change the number? Yeah, Alright. Okay, so here we have a deck of cards and these cards have actually been shuffled. Mm -hmm. Right? Okay, they're already shuffled, right? Okay. So now mm -hmm. I'll pass this deck of cards to Amma. Okay. And I want Amma to count from the top card. Mm -hmm. Count ten. So one, two, three, four, five. 7, 8, 8, 9, 10. 10. Okay, cool. So I'll take this. I'll take okay. this. Okay, so I might have 10 cards here, right? Right. So now, okay, I'm going to hold this card. Right. Okay. We're going to create four piles. Mm -hmm. So first, I'm going to take the top card and then mm -hmm. put one, mm -hmm. and then two, mm -hmm. three, mm -hmm. four, and continue back again until the card ends. So now we have our four piles. So I want Amma to turn over the first card. Okay, so Amma got one, uh, ace. ace. <laughs> okay, so why Amma turn the next card? It's a game. Okay, uh, interesting. Okay. Yep. So now turn over the third card. Oh, <laughs> this is amazing. And now the last card, huh? Amma get this kind of combination, right? So, I will reveal how this game is done at the end of this video. Okay? Cool. Welcome, Appa and Anya. So today, we have a very simple game. And this game is basically to encourage people to will trust on your instinct. Okay? Alright. So, between 10 to 25, 10 to 25, I want you both to come up with a number that you agree upon. You choose that. <laughs> 14. <laughs> 21. You both have to agree on the number. 21. One time <laughs> yeah? You agree to 21? I agree. Scissors paper. 14. Scissors uh, paper. Okay, come. 22. Okay, you need. Okay, 14. 14. Okay. 14. okay. 14. okay. No, we even need 21. I need to say 14. Right? Yeah, 14 is 14. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> so, okay, I have a deck of cards that has been shuffled because uh, yeah, it has been shuffled. Alright, so, by everyone, everyone touched the card. Okay, okay so, uh, I want Anne yeah. to play the card. The whole thing. The whole thing. Okay. okay, I want Anne to draw 14 cards starting from the top. Just like one by one. Yeah. Right? One, two, three, four. Okay. Okay. So here there are 14 cards, right? So now, okay. Who wants to draw the card? Okay. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, okay. So far there's 14 cards here. Okay. So far we will create four files starting from the top card. So the first card here. First card here. Yeah. Second card. Third. Fourth. Okay. And I'll repeat here. Here, 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 again. Okay, here, here. Alright. 
Okay, so we will do half half one. So can Apa turn over the first card? First card. Yes, the top card. Ace. Ace. Okay. 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 We should get a D there. Okay. Yes. Yeah, so, C and D. So can Apa turn over the second card? So logically, we would feel it's impossible to actually draw four aces from a pile of randomly shuffled cards, right? So when it actually happens, when we draw the four aces, our mind actually gets stuck. And this is what we call a mental fixation. So we're so used to understanding that the cards work in a very specific way and not the other. So it's a really, really simple game and all you need is just a deck of 52 cards and make sure when you shuffle it, you keep the four aces on the top of the deck. Alright? So it's a really fun game to do with your family and friends and have fun. <laughs> 